Hey guys, I hope you guys are blessed and well on today, Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. I'm seeing somebody getting a whole bunch of um, packages or something. It's, it's like something is sitting at your front door. You could be away from your house or something, but I'm picking up um, somebody getting a whole bunch of packages. I feel like you're expecting this though. You dig a rescue? I hope y'all day is just amazing, bro. It's a great day. It's a great day fucking day bruh it's a great day it's a great day to have some bread a great day to be loved a great day to give love receive love what i said child it is just so beautiful out here it was raining earlier <clears throat> it seems like some kind of scattered showers or thunderstorms or something but it's still beautiful i'm actually just now getting out the house y'all i have not been drinking coffee i have not I don't know why because I normally bro when I get up like that's like the first thing like when I when I leave out of the house if I'm gonna leave out the house I'm going straight to Duncan what I said child I haven't been craving any coffee I haven't been wanting any so Duncan I still love y'all boo I promise you that but I just I haven't been drinking coffee it's something about it um that I just haven't been craving I don't know <sighs> but anyway, that could be significant to somebody. Definitely could be very significant. Somebody needs some new tires, new brakes or something like that. I feel like y'all just getting all new stuff. But it's something about a bunch of packages being outside somebody dang on door. I heard the word hypnosis too. You're very hypnotizing to somebody. Somebody is very intrigued with you is what I want to say. This person is... This, this person is very infatuated with you. I don't want to say that they're a stalker or they're creepy or anything like that. I just feel like this person is watching you from a distance. They're not saying much, okay? So, whatever this is about these packages, and I see a FedEx truck right there. That's confirmation. Whatever it is about all these packages, I feel like you're expecting them, but it's, some, it's another package wrapped in a tiny bowl that you're not expecting. Somebody might, child, seem like somebody uh, gonna meet the love of their life. They could be a delivery driver or some shit. I don't know. I know I had picked up on that like a year ago. That <laughs> somebody person was a um a delivery driver. I mean, <laughs> what they got to do with it? I feel like you got to start from somewhere. What I said. Somebody done stop drinking, stop smoking, stop doing something. I'm so proud of you guys, bro, for all these things that you are accomplishing. This is why, this is why uh, the Most High God keeps blessing you. Why you're so abundant, why you're going to continue to be abundant, what I said. I heard screech. Screech. So it's definitely something with somebody tires. And also screech. Oh, saved by the bell. Thank you, Holy Spirit. If yeah, somebody's going to ring somebody's doorbell. Also, to be careful of somebody approaching your home or approaching you like, do I know you? Oh, I thought you were such and such. This is somebody who's been watching you. Now I'm picking up on that stalker energy, bro. I'm getting a whole lot of downloads right now. At this time, bro, y'all are too close to some. That's just what I want to tell you right here, fam. Basically. You're too close to something to be fooled. Do not be fooled. Do not be manipulated. Do not be persuaded. And all that shit really be the same shit, right? <laughs> but don't be fooled, bro. Because somebody is playing games. It's like, um, because I know for sure, Casamigos is significant. I know for sure I had picked up on somebody... I picked up on somebody literally trying to cloak your person's energy because they're like right there. It's like you're you're gonna be able to know who's who though. The who's who. I'm hearing party next door. Somebody literally could be having a party next door. It sounds like they're having a party next door. It's like so much fucking noise. I don't feel like you mind though. Whoever you are, you live alone. I feel like somebody may be trying to agitate you. You may have a neighbor that's just like making unnecessary ass fucking noise. Um, but somebody is trying to cloak your person. They're trying to cloak the energy of your twin flame. This is somebody, somebody last name Sanders. Deion Sanders is significant as well. Somebody's son definitely is a football star. I heard rock star, rock and roll. Somebody be like this when they be driving. 
Yo ass be rocking when you be rolling. But yeah, this motherfucker is is they they like cloaking your person's energetic field. But they're doing they're doing this in a way to where you can't tell if they're your person or if your actual person is your person. So I feel like this is somebody from your past. This is somebody who you've had communication with before. For a lot of y'all, bro, you need to watch out for these stalkers, bro, because you got somebody following you. I heard on foot. This person does not want to be seen in a certain vehicle. Maybe you know their vehicle or something. So they're walking around. Or it's a, a, a vehicle that you just keep seeing somewhere. It's this fucking person. But they're going to try to approach your home or approach you on foot. What I said. Somebody going to also notice that security is walking around on foot. Instead of patrolling in a vehicle. It's because something is going on. I'm seeing somebody pull up to their home and it's police every fucking where. Wow. This seems like some apartments. I heard Chris hidden hidden you could have hidden or crest or something like that in your apartments it's like something is um something is going on in somebody's home but this is going to be an indication this is going to be um confirmation of this person walking around your home flower pots are significant it's, it's something that this person is doing it's like they're they're trying to fuck with something outside of your home okay thank you holy spirit thank you if you got like a garden or something, this person is literally coming in your garden, rearranging your shit. Like they're trying to, they're, they want you to know that somebody's following you, but they don't want you to know who, what I said. And this is not to paranoid anybody. This is to uh, have you to be set focused solely on continuing to strive forward and understand that somebody is fucking with you and to take the necessary steps when you're not aware of certain shit then that's one thing but when you are aware of things that's another thing you dig a rich you i heard hidden valley it's something hidden period i keep hearing hidden hidden object hidden hidden also to be cautious when you're driving hidden 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 somebody is trying to man I'm going to rebuke that in Jesus' name. I'm not even going to say that. But somebody is playing games is what I want to say. Somebody drops a Cadillac, period. I know I had saw a Cadillac in my mind. I, maybe about three days ago when I was doing a reading. And this person keeps coming up in the energy. This person is a fucking magician. They really know how to cloak their energy. They, they are very good at cloaking. Because... This person, um, their energy popped up like real, real heavy. And then it like subsided. First of all, half of these folks be getting their shit. So let's just put it there. But I feel like you have more than one energy. You have more than one person that carries this same fucking um, monitoring, monitoring spirit or something. It's like they have to see everything that you're doing. Amazon confirmation again. It's something about packages outside of somebody's door. It's like you leave out the house, no packages, and you come back, and it's like packages everywhere. I, but I said I feel like you're expecting these packages. But see, the thing of it is, you're going to leave out the house for like 10 minutes. You're not even going to be gone long. Seems like you may be gone, uh, going to the gas station or something like that. I heard coconut water. Somebody loves Vita coconut water. That is called Vita, right? V-I-T-A. Vito the singer is significant as well. And hey, shout out to him because he definitely found his fuck and he got a nice ass voice. Vito the singer. Vito, you got it. I'm hearing that song, You Got It by Vito. V E D O. Go listen to that song, Fam Masculine. You got it. It's like God, God lifted you up out of the pit or something. FedEx again. That's confirmation. Somebody not listening, shouty. Somebody is not listening. Somebody is just obviously not fucking listening to something. Or you need to listen to something. You need to listen very carefully to something. You may even hear this person talking outside of your home. Or you may hear them like fumbling around outside of your home. Somebody got a big ass gun. These, bro, these people need to stop playing. They're going another bed. It's comfort fucking mation, bro. So you could be having some things getting um shit from P uh it's my name Pete. You not UPS. What am I talking about? FedEx. Or maybe UPS and it could be Amazon too. 
chilies, baby back ribs, barbecue sauce. It's significant. Somebody love barbecue sauce. Somebody put barbecue sauce on every goddamn thing. Somebody eating Chinese food. That fortune cookie. I heard is the answer to a problem that you've been trying to solve. If you are eating Chinese food or you did, you still have a fortune cookie in your drawer or something. Like you kept the fortune cookie, you didn't eat it. Go and open it. I heard, don't forget to eat it. Somebody's very superstitious. Child, what is the Holy Spirit giving me today? Yeah, it's just, I'm, hear, I'm hearing bling, bling. Every time I come around, I say that, bling, bling. Somebody buying a lot of damn jewelry. This masculine little jewelry, we're told. This masculine be icy as a motherfucker right here. I'm hearing Bill Nye, the science guy. Somebody named Butter or Bubba or something like that. It is two more FedEx trucks right there. Wow. It's a whole lot of confirmation about some packages. Okay. It's, so, it's something coming to you special delivery. Now I'm hearing that song special delivery by uh, Lil Wayne. Hey, Weezy. I love you, baby. There go another FedEx. I ain't no way. I mean, maybe they all... It's kind of late in the day, but... I don't know. I, I mean, I, I, I come this way. I, I've never seen this many Fed X. Excuse me. And you got a Fed Up X. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Spirit, like, how many trucks we need to show you? How many trucks we need to show you, sis? <laughs> you have a Fed Up X that's traveling here. You got an X that's fed up. And this person also about to go to the feds. They about to go to prison. I'm hearing stomp the yard. Somebody trying to trample over your plants or something. It's something with your garden. Arden's garden could be significant, but somebody loves planting. You have a green thumb and this person knows that you love your garden. Like you really take pride in this garden. You could have even won like competitions or something with your garden or some shit oh i know who you are you that person who always decorating a damn house around christmas time and you always get um some kind of award or uh maybe you even got your house posted in a, a magazine or something or that's something like that is going to happen what i said child i know who you are i picked up on you when i was on tiktok so maybe you came from tiktok to here if you if you if you started watching me from TikTok, this is definitely your message. Because I don't even think of TikTok at all. So for that to come up, that's significant. We. I don't know, fam, masculine. But it's a whole lot of good things happening in your life. And it's like somebody's trying to block you. They're trying to stop you by any means necessary. And you have a lot of enemies. You got a lot of enemies that's doing anything by any means. What I said, child, ain't none of that shit gonna work, though. That's what I'm trying to say right here for him. I said, ain't none of that shit working. Jerk chicken is significant. Somebody be selling meat. Somebody sell, like, um, not, not, not meat that's already cooked, but it's like meat. Like, somebody sell meat. Or somebody could be a butcher. So, oh, somebody works at Publix. I heard Boris say it. Whoever you is, bro, you're very strong. You are a very strong individual. You cannot be broken. You cannot be beat. You can't be stopped. What I said. Bruh, I'm sending out so much love and light and abundance to whoever you is, bro. I'm telling you, the devil is on your ass, but have no fear. Somebody stopping at Taco Bell. I hope you're going right home after that. <laughs> I heard the shitter. <laughs> your ass going to be on the shitter. <laughs> But um, much love and light to you, bro. Because whoever you are, you've been fighting. And I mean for a long time. But see, the thing about it is you've been fighting so much you don't even recognize. Like whoever you wish out and you do not understand why God is giving you all of this. Because whoever you wish, you feel like you're not enough or you haven't done enough or you don't deserve something because all of this bad shit is happening. It's nothing bad happening to you. You're in spiritual warfare. What I said. 
you're in spiritual warfare. The fact that you got eyes on me and ears to hear me goes to show you that you have won your degree skill. And God is literally handing you something. It's like a layup, a alley. Like God is handing this to you, him, himself. God himself is. And it's like nobody can block you from it. Nobody can stop you. They can't talk you out of it. We, it's something here. Bro, but it's something about this. But this motherfucker keep trying to get away. I feel the energy, bro. This fucking man is stalking the hell out of the feminine, bro. Or or masculines could be you too. Somebody stalking somebody, and that shit ain't fucking cool, bro. That stalking shit is not fucking cute. They're following you on foot now because you know their vehicle or something, or you keep seeing this same damn car, and now. They're just going to start walking around your fucking neighborhood here. We just be aware of that when you're going to your car and shit, especially late at night. Seems like somebody trying to catch somebody at night. Time man, fuck you. The hell is you tired? Nobody's scared of you motherfuckers, bro. Somebody wants you to be terrified, but I don't feel like you are. I mean, there's no reason for you to be. I feel like the most high God is covering you. Somebody is really paranoid or something. I feel like you be seeing a person or feeling their energy or something, but they have literally gone so far to cloak. They they want to be unseen, undetectable. What I said, this motherfucker, you can still detect. Like, whoever you are, you pick up on energy from any... Bro, do these people not understand what being an empath is? Motherfuckers can pick up energy on a groundhog what are you talking about you can go hide in the same hole of groundhog in bitch and i'm still gonna know what the fuck you got going on ho you're truly gifted you truly have gifts from the most high god i heard the word sensitivity somebody can have sensitivity to their teeth or something i heard sensodyne maybe you're uh changing your toothbrushes or toothpaste or something i don't know oh chris okay somebody somebody is a dentist or something or something like that. I don't know. Or you could be getting work done on your teeth. Somebody named Asia or Ava. Somebody's in a world of fucking trouble. Just period. Okay. I'm going to leave it here, Fan Masculine. Remember that God loves you and so do I. Bye, y'all.